We're back, and so we're on the Gateway Exchange. You have chosen to part exchange your current gateway for the Trinity 186A Gateway, as opposed to the Trinity 1686B Gateway. If you choose to proceed, the money will be deducted from your account, and Uplink Corporation will prepare your new gateway. We will install identical hardwares in your new gateway, and we will copy your memory banks from your current system to your new system. The process will take around 24 hours. After this time, you will have to log off from the net and log back on again. You will then be rerouted to your new gateway, and your old one will be immediately dismantled. It will cost that much. We've got plenty of money. Proceed. This will take about 24 hours, at which we will fire you. Well, we could speed up time to get it, but uh, why don't we finish up with just a few more of these things first? Okay. Well, after the spectacle you witnessed, you this might be not so interesting to watch, but let's do it anyway. Load, um, we need to head over to the media uh, net one, right? Okay, um... Oh, uh... You're doing that automatic, just click, choosing the password breaker and choosing this tries to automatically go for admin, but we're not going for admin. In fact, you you have to actually choose admin from the previous uh, screen thing to go into admin. So here we go, 2144203. And the androgynous, cool, rather obstinate, nifty youngest machine assures me that yes, things will get more interesting. We will have exciting missions. And not just doing the same thing over and over. Okay, so let's find out the size of his loan. Uh, view account. His loan is 2300. Okay. Enter Nick. Admin. Studious. Access logs. Delete the usual. Here's two random accessed files, but there aren't any files, so I'm not sure what that's doing there. Maybe they were from some hacker who um, changed things. In that case, can we undelete them? Let's. Oh, wait, we don't have the log on deleter. Or maybe they're just there for flavor. So, someone impersonated logs for flavor? What kind of flavor? Is this ice cream flavor? Whatever. Okay, now we've, we're done with uh, that. Um, now we need to go to Unity uh, Systems. Yeah, we might as well uh, finish up the remaining of this part doing this, and then we'll, um, you know, speed things up and stuff. Okay, manage existing account. The number is 1625879. By the way, when we get upgraded, these th this will go much faster. Proceed, view account, find the size of his loan, which is zero, send. Leader. Technically, we can get the log leader after we do this, but hey, uh, I mean, get to choose it after we go over here, but this way it goes faster. And again, banks track you fast. Best to do this as quickly as possible. What's next? Um, corruption, we'll look at that later. Why not go through the international security systems, uh, international social security thing again? Where is that again? Okay.
So, once again, what you need to do is this. Start the password breaker. But now we can just use the... Uh, first, let's set this to its maximum speed. Except now we can go to bypass and choose proxy bypass. Best of all, you don't even need to set this to a high CPU or anything. It can be just plain bottom and it'll work fine. Now if I had used a monitor bypass, what that would have meant is it wouldn't have started tracking me until after I had gotten through with the password breaker. So it's good in some cases where uh, you just want to make sure they don't start tracking you until the very latest possible. The monitor bypass. Okay, search records, what is it we need to do? Oh yeah, we were on here, uh... Okay. Alex Pritchard. So all of these social security databases are pretty much the same. Hacking, get past a, a proxy server, search for the person's name, uh, wait until it finds it, and then make whatever change they want. In this case, it's changed to seized to employed because they're trying to make a new identity or something. Okay, here's another one. Okay, search records. Now we need to change him to deceased. Again, exactly the same thing, you're just changing one thing to a different thing, rather than a different thing to another thing. Okay, 24 more seconds. Is there anything else we need to do while we're here? Nope. Well, let's look at these. Yay, I got money. Ooh, now I'm a professional. Oh wait, how, what is my ranking now? Let's see... Number three. Anything interesting in the news? Absolutely nothing! Man, I keep thinking there will be something interesting. Your Neuromancer rating? It is now untrustworthy. Ah! That is how the hacker community uh, views you. It goes up when you destroy corporation stuff, and it goes down when you're mean to normal people. Like, you know, by changing stuff in the social security database. Who cares what they think? Okay, so, um, I guess that's pretty much it. Um, yep, okay, so now let's uh, speed things up a bit so, they, uh, so we can have them uh, install the new gateway. What, uh... We have finished preparing your gateway machine, we have installed identical hardware in this new gateway, and we have copied your memory banks into the new system. In order to complete the upgrade, you must now log out from Uplink. When you next log back into the system, you will be automatically redirected to your new gateway system. We'll then immediately dismantle your old system and wipe the memory banks of all data stored. Or, okay, so we just gotta disconnect. No problem. We'll log out, and in fact, this is a pretty good time to uh, just end period, because I've been doing this for a while. Okay, see you next time with a new snazzier gateway. Okay, so, um, yep, that's it. See you next time!